SMT Nation, what is going on? It's your boy, the SMT. Glad you could make it for this video. Thanks for stopping by, and I do appreciate you being here. If it's your first time here, consider subscribing. If you like this video, give it a rating, or if you don't like it, rate it poorly. Whatever you like to do, appreciate the engagement. All right, so we've got something that Jason shared with me. All right, big shout out to you, Jason. I was actually looking for more speed tests like this. This is AT&T 5G Plus, and this is one of the harder things to kind of get access to only because AT&T hasn't really scaled it like Verizon has. I mean, 5G ultra wideband on Verizon in terms of the millimeter wave is scaling really well. All things considered that it's a, you know, it's, it's not the type of coverage that's like a mid band, for example, like with T-Mobile's ultra capacity 5G mid band with the N41. This is a lot more limited in how fast it could be deployed. So it's hard to get a hold of screenshots and experiences, people sharing these with me. So when I get them, I do appreciate them. So 1.7 gigs per second on the downlink, 89 megabits per second on the uplink. We got a ping time of 12 millisecond, jitter at 3.2, a little bit of loss at 1.7%. I would say that that's a pretty good test for AT&T's 5G+. It's not as fast as Verizon's. Uh, Verizon, typically, we see speed tests over 2 gigs. Over 3 gigs now has become quite the norm. We've seen people pushing 4 gigs per second on the downlink. And the reason why I think this is suitable is because, again, AT&T is strategically and kind of on a situational basis using 5G+. Plus. Meanwhile, Verizon is using it as a home internet as well as mobility play. So it's a little bit different in terms of how they're going to scale it and what they expect from it. So this is pretty encouraging in my estimation. Those ping times are a lot better than what I see here in Cleveland. So overall, I think this is a pretty nice test. Jason, thanks for sharing. If any of you out there have access to 5G Plus sites from AT&T, please do share them with me. You can share them with me on Twitter uh, or you can email them to me. Both of those links are in the description box. I'd like to be able to present this and then maybe I can kind of put together some kind of like a catalog of speed tests from all over the country and you guys can be engaged with the channel more. And that's really what I'm trying to do with this. So thanks for sharing this, Jason. And if you guys are out there and you would like to kind of share those with me, that would be great. I appreciate it in advance. Thank you. And uh, again, don't forget to subscribe for more content. We've got tons and tons of coverage happening in this whole 5G renaissance. So also, don't forget to rate this video. Thank you. Share it if you want to help out the channel. All the stuff that we're doing here on the channel is also in the description box. The email address, the, uh, the, email address, the Twitter, also the Patreon page link if you want to become a supporter there. It's all there. Thank you in advance for your considerations. We will see you all in the next video. Peace.